Well, we're looking at an averages uh, problem here. Okay, it says uh, got three integers. Integers means whole numbers. Okay, that have a mean of seven, a median of five, and a range of fourteen. So the first thing I would do would be well, here are my three numbers. Now, mean of seven means that they've got to add. Uh, sorry, add to to twenty one. 3 times 7, okay, because we know we add, to work out the mean, we need to add up all the data and divide by how many we've got, so 3 times 7, um, the median uh, of 5 means that the middle number's got to be 5 when they're in order, so that's easy, I can put that straight there, okay, and the range of 14 uh, means that the biggest minus, so biggest minus littlest equals 14, all right, so that's all my clues. Uh, they've got to add to make 21 now. So that means that this one and this one have now got to add to make 16, and they've got to differ by 14. Well, that makes it pretty straightforward, does it not? Uh, I'll do them in green, so we should have 15 and 1. There we go. All right, so we should therefore put them in order. There we go. Now, no other sets of numbers will work. So. My advice when doing this sort of thing is, you know how many numbers there are, so start fitting them in. I've put I put three blanks there, and then start filling them in using the um, using the information. Mean means add up and divide by how many there are, so you can you know what they've got to add up to. Uh, median you know is in the middle uh, once they're in order, and uh, and range is just highest one as well. It like I say all these things are slightly different, so but um. It's just setting them up uh, nicely so that you can fill in blanks where possible is pretty crucial here.